Welcome back to Randy's DIY. Today we have a Acer Chromebook. Matter of fact, it's an Acer C722 series, and I'm going to let you in on a little secret. They have a problem that Acer is aware of, and they will send you free parts to repair it. So let's get into it. Acer C722 series Chromebook, and it says screen keeps going on and off. And that is a common known issue with these. And I'm gonna show you how to change the screen on them. So if you notice, black, it's powered on, it's black. Sometimes you can tap on them, make them come on, most of the time not. Sometimes you open it up and close it, it'll flash. <clears throat> so here's what we're gonna do. Take you a little spudger. Go into the corner, just keep prying out. These are really easy to get off, unlike Dell's. Um, really easy to pop off, just pry it out with your fingers there. Throw it over to the side. We got four screws, exactly the same as the Dell Chromebooks. We remove these four here, top, bottom corners on the side of the screen. They're a little black screw. Get these four removed, lay the uh, Chromebook screen over. I like to use an X-Acto knife here and we just start right on this side and slice underneath it. Once you get it sliced over, fold that back, grab it with your finger, pull it over. Once it pops loose, we'll take this tape, hold it up and flip this same little spring up. Stick it to the tape, pinch the spring and the tape together, and just kind of twist it off. Screen's out. Let me go grab another screen. We'll put it in there. That screen, you should be able to call Acer and tell them that you have a defective screen on your Chromebook. Even if the Chromebook's out of warranty, they might still replace it for you. I'm going to pause the video for a second while I go get a screen. Okay, here we are back with the screen, new shiny screen. And basically just like the Dell, if you've seen some of my other videos, we'll slide this back here, lay it down flat, carefully line this up, and slide that sucker on there. Clip down the little metal bracket, <clears throat> stick the tape back down, Flip the screen up. Down here, you'll have some channels. Uh, goes in the bottom and then up to the middle. And those little channels. I'm gonna take our screws and put back in the screen. I'm just gonna put one in for testing. So it don't fall out. All right, and this is what you're gonna do here. Hold the power button now for six or seven seconds. You've seen it flash. <clears throat> and you should come on. You may have to release and then power it back on again. But with that being said, we got uh, a backlit screen now. The uh, screens that came in these are, uh, I believe they were like a Innova or something. I don't remember what the brand of them were, but they all had problems with the backlights going out on them. Acer has acknowledged that problem and they are standing behind their product. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and stick the rest of the screws in the screen and we'll show you how to snap the bezel back on. Uh, you can use a PH1 screwdriver bit on these screws. <clears throat> All right, everything's in here. Don't forget to pull your clear protection off of the screen. Set the bottom into the hooks and then start at the top. Pinch right on each side of the camera and just work yourself a, a, work yourself around the screen. When you get to the bottom, we're going to hold on the back of the screen and then run your fingers across there, snapping all that together. You can lay this hinge back and push down on these two to snap those. And when you get through, close it and check this back area right here to make sure that there's no gaps and it's all snapped together good. And that's it. <clears throat> you just fixed your Acer 722 
the Chromebook with a new screen. And like I said, call uh, Acer and they might hook you up with a new screen there. Thanks a lot. Have a good day. Don't forget to press the like button, comment, subscribe. Uh, if it helped you out, save some money. Click on the super thanks button. Bye-bye. Hey there, amazing viewers. So you've just watched the video that's probably changed your life or at least made you giggle a little bit, right? Well, if you want to show a little extra love and support, I've got a tiny favor to ask of you. Below this video, you'll see a magical button that says thanks. Yes, that button, the one that you're looking at. It's like a digital high five, but way cooler because it comes with a sprinkle of gratitude. If you don't see it, don't panic. Just click those three dots over there. It's like a secret passageway to gratitude land. Seriously, it's like a treasure hunt, but instead of gold, you get a chance to support this channel. Uh, so if you're feeling generous or just want to say, hey, I appreciate you, please consider clicking that button. Every click is like a tiny cheer in the background, making me do a little happy dance. Trust me, it's a sight to behold. Thanks for being awesome, and let's keep this wild adventure going together. Have a good day.